Alright guys, here we are, next set of notes. So, make sure you have paper and pencil out ready to copy down your notes, alright? So, first thing we're going to do is, is we're going to identify the names of our note, the name of our notes. And it's called, Write in Slope Intercept, for, intercept Form from a Graph. Alright, so we're going to write an equation from a graph, right? We're going to get all the information that we need from the graph and we're going to write the equation in slope intercept form right or y equals ms plus b so first thing we need to know is we're going to find the y intercept right and another and the letter that represents the y intercept is b right that's step one right? step two is we're going to find another point, right? We're going to find another point. It's going to be exactly right, right in the center where two lines cross. Right. Step three, we're going to find the slope, right? And in math, we remember that slope is equal to M, right? And then finally, the last step, is we're going to write the equation in slope intercept form or y equals mx plus b right meaning that the two highlighted parts that we need are m and we need b right we need m and we need b to write it to write the equation in this form y equals mx plus b the important parts being m and b Right. M is slope, B is y-intercept. Okay, So let's take a look at this first example here. So we remember that the two things we need are B and we need M. Right. So B, step one, is the y-intercept. Right. The y-intercept. So where does that blue line touch our y-axis? This is the y-axis. Where does it touch the blue line? It touches it right there, right? At two. So B is equal to two, okay? Step two says, find another point. So we're gonna find another point, exactly. It can't be here, look, because it's not in the, right in the middle there. It can't be here. It's not right in the center there. Can't be there. It's not right there. This one is a little off. It's not right in the center, but this one is right there. See? So, we're going to go green right there. So, how do I get from red to green? Right? Well, I have to go down. Right? So, Unfortunately, it cannot go diagonal, so I got to go down first, right? So I go down one. Now, I only went down one because I want to go this way to get to green. If I go down one more, look, I've passed it. Or down another one, I've passed it. Or down another one, I've passed it. So I only went down one, right? And now to the right, I go one, two, three, four, five. So I went down one and I went over to the right, five. So if I went down one, that means my slope was negative one over to the right five is five. There you go, look at that. Now I remembered, so that was my third, look. I found my slope. I found M. And finally, the last point is, the last uh, um, step is write the equation in Y equals MX plus B form. So, Y equals MX plus B form. But look what I can replace. I can replace M and I can replace B with these numbers right here. So I say Y 
is equal to, what is m? m is equal to negative 1 over 5. So I put negative 1 over 5. x plus, what is my b? My b is 2. So, 2. And that's my equation. Look at that. I found my equation from my graph. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. That's my equation right there. All right. Let's do number two. So, again, number two is, step one is find the y-intercept or b. So, I know I'm going to need b and I'm going to need m. B is my y-intercept where the y touches the blue line. And where does it touch? It touches right there. And that's 1, right? Because this is 0, 1, 2. So this is 1. So B is equal to 1. Okay? Step 2 says find another point. So let us find another point, an exact point, right? It can't be that one. That one's a little off. This one's a little off. So is this one. That one's a little off as well. This one looks perfect right there, look. So this one right here. Here we go. So how do I get from red to green? Well. I need to go down, right? So how many spaces do I go down? Let's see. One, two, three, four, right? So I went down four. Right? And now I want to go to the left. One, two, three. So I went to the left three. So what does that look like as my slope? So I went down four, so that means negative four, over to the left three, that's negative three. And look what happens when you divide a negative divided by a negative cancels out. So you're left with just four over three, right? There you go. That was my step three. Find my slope, m. Then, last step is write the equation in slope-intercept form. y equals mx plus b. Right? So, that's right. y equals mx plus b. And we're going to replace m. And we're going to replace b. Right? So, y equals my m is equal to 4 over 3. 4 over 3, x plus my b is equal to 1. 1. And that right there is my equation from my slope. Right, I found my equation for my slope. Okay, and that right there, kudos, is how you find an equation in slope intercept form from a graph. Okay, so make sure you have everything copied down. Okay, in order for you to be ready for your assignment. All right, thank you.